really great. Um, I misspoke before in the beginning of the show. I said uh, Mark was not going to be back till Thursday. So, but I'm making this for him to welcome him back home. Uh, but we made enough cake for everybody and then for him because Oreos happen to be his very favorite thing in the whole wide world up there. You can that's his private stash up no. there. No, nobody's is way up high. Nobody can reach oh, it. Funny. Yeah, he loves Oreo cookies. His dad, his dad, that was his dad's favorite. So it's something very sentimental sure. to him. Uh, so I know he loves this too. He loves chocolate. You, who doesn't love chocolate, right? You know what I'm going to do for you guys right now? I have some Oreo cookies, and this is the chocolate that we've already melted. So I'm going to uh -oh. give you just this, just to hold Give it you to over. the fitness guru. Yeah, oh, well, there, we're sharing. There you go. Half the calories. There you, go. Uh, you know what? Why don't we bring out little pieces of cake for everybody to enjoy? Oh, now, um, this little is, pieces. Little pieces. <laughs> you could do one or two things with this recipe. If you want to go ahead and use a cake mix uh, in a box, you can. But it, it you know, it doesn't have the same flavor. Uh, the recipe mm. for this is on the website. It's my recipe, and it, it takes a, a little time, not a lot, but I highly suggest that you do it because the cake comes out very moist and dense and it's it's almost e like eating a, uh, a a moose cake it's very you you went for the milk right away right because oh, it's that it's, 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 it's chocolate awesome. it's, it's it, death it's, by chocolate this is, this is your favorite yeah yeah this is me this is that you, oh, you know okay. there's a place called death by chocolate <laughs> there is there's a cookbook too death yeah. by chocolate mm. uh, i have to talk to the guru fitness Denise is not eating anything <laughs> well, but katie's you. eating <laughs> i gave you in moderation that's been my forte okay so, why well, as long one, as you're exercising yeah, i gave you one so you guys can split it all right, so uh, we're going to go ahead and get wow. started. The first thing we're going to do is place your rack in the middle part of the oven because you want the heat to circulate evenly. So we have the rack in there, and you're going to preheat it to about 325 degrees. You're going to take a 9 by 3 inch round cake pan. It's your average cake pan. I put some uh, parchment paper on the bottom to make it easier for you to uh, take your cake out when it's ready. And I sprayed it and I buttered it as well. And then you're going to flour it again to make it much easier for the cake to come out. You just put that over there. And then we'll come over here to actually make the cake. In here I have the flour, the cocoa, sugar, baking soda, baking powder, salt. And what we did was we sifted it. And we have it here in uh, our mixer. And so I'm going to turn this on low. And to that, I'm going to add sugar. Yes, I am. I'm going to add the sugar. Just mix that in. Does anybody watch Ina Weingarten? I love it when she makes cakes. You know, the way she mm -hmm. talks about it. It's so smooth and everything. I'm not quite as smooth as she is, but I still love baking. I actually took a baking course. So I could get my degree and my chef's degree in baking because I am not a good baker because I don't like to measure. I'm one of those cooks that <laughs> like to throw things in there. This I do, this, I do the same thing. Yeah, it, it disagrees with you? It disagrees with you. What, You're what you a very good baker. Oh, well, yeah. <laughs> thank you. Well, it, it takes a lot of patience and a lot of time. Um, I'm going to add some oil into the mixture like this until it all starts to come together. While that's coming together, I'm going to whisk together two eggs and to that I'm going to add some milk and some vanilla extract. Mm -hmm, I'm going to mix mm -hmm. this up like this. I just wanted to show you the steps because even though it looks like it's complicated, it really is not. Now to our oil and our uh, flour, we're going to add the egg, yolk, the egg mixture into here. Again, so you have to do these things slow. I would do it much slower at home, but we don't have much time to do it here. And you don't want to mix it too much because you don't want the gluten and the flour to um, activate too much because that's when you get a cake that's, well, this is very dense to begin with, but you still don't want it to, oh, it's all coming together. Look, it looks like chocolate mousse. Oh my gosh, that's mm. so great. Okay, now, word of caution here. This is boiling water. Okay, it's very hot. And you have to be careful when you're putting it into the mixture because you don't want it to come right back at you. So I'm standing back a little bit <laughs> and wish me luck. Okay, and we're going to turn it on. No, see? You're yeah, good. there we go. Don't throw in. Yeah, okay. There we go. I okay. talk more, but I'm eating so much of this cake right now. It's you so talked good. about what? I talk more, but this is really good. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, okay. So Are your kids enjoying you. that? I took both of his <laughs> drinks. I do not want to be on the ride home with your parents when you guys. <laughs> <laughs> They'll be on the roof. <laughs> all right, so they're going to be on the roof. So we're going to bring this all together, and then when it comes all together, I'm going to turn this off. It's going to be nice and ooey gooey, like I'll have a consistency mm -hmm. like mm -hmm. a chocolate pudding. You're going to put it wow. into your cake pan. I suggest to, this is a recipe for one nine by three cake, but when you make this cake, I suggest that you double the recipe because when you do that and you bring the cake out, you oh. put one on top of the other. And it's going to turn out. Ooh. Serious birthday cake. Oh my yeah. God. Yeah. Now, there's our two layers.
layers. And what I did was I cut the layers in, you know, I cut a layer into the first one and another layer, and I opened it up and I put a white cream cheese frosting so it'll look like an Oreo cookie in the middle, so it's all white in the middle. But I think uh, today what um, what we did is we put chocolate, but mm -hmm. I usually like to do the white frosting so it'll look more like an Oreo oh, cookie. Oh, white frosting? Yeah, a white frosting. So it looks like, like an Oreo because frosting. if you do that, how do you yeah. eat an Oreo? Do you open yours up and I just no, eat it? I just, just eat it. I, 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 just <laughs> eat, I eat it with milk. I do too. I like to dunk it in milk till it gets soft, but I, I like to open it up and then eat the white part. So for the full uh, recipe, where did you get well, this? Um, well, you could go to our website, but I just wanted to show you one thing. Uh, What's the name yeah. of that page? What page? What do you mean? What page? Website. Oh. Because I will say that word wrong. It's a Pinterest. Oh, the Pinterest. Pinterest. Yeah. What it's you a do? weird word for me. Yeah. So just, is it? Is it? It's yeah. a Pinterest. Have you ever page been on Pinterest? The it's the best risk. thing in the world. I have world. to go and look. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, you're gonna look. Sam, I'm too busy. On Pinterest, I'm too busy you? looking at the yeah. golf. Okay. All right, here. So what we're going to do is I'm going to stick websites. this on <laughs> like this. Whoops. Yeah, so that you're supposed to like use well, it. Well, you do it. You put it on right away normally, yeah. right? Yeah, I mean, well, you what you want to do is on. when the cake comes out of the oven, please make sure that you cool the cake completely because when you put the ganache on it, which is this frosting here, it'll melt and it'll go all over the place. So you want to make sure that your cake is completely. I like ganache. Ganache. I, I know like I like say saying it. it too. Ganache. Ganache. All right, and then uh, you do this all the way around, and then what I like to do is I, I <coughs> stick. You can make a face up there. Too, you know? Yeah, you yeah. could if you yeah. wanted. You can make a That's smiley face. That's my kids having to do on pancakes. Yeah. I always oh, got a whipped cream yes. face. All right, there you go. <laughs> Isn't that right? <laughs> so there. You yeah, I'm going to cut a little slice out of it right now. A little wow. slice of heaven. Mm. So I'm going to do the back part right here. Okay, so here we go. I'm going to cut this. Oh, look at it. Very nice. Yeah. Okay. Oops. I'm gonna take that off like that. Where's my dish? Where's so the double the calories? I don't have a dish. The but yeah, I'm going to just I'll use this. Here we go. And then beautiful. Mm. Oh the drum roll. Get a drum roll. Oh. Ta -da. That's very cool. Drum roll. That's another piece of you guys look like you have oh enough over gosh. there. Okay, so there it is. And also, this cake will, um, will last in the refrigerator before you frost it. The cake part will last in the refrigerator, covered tightly, airtight for two weeks. Wow. And then wow. you can use your ganache. The recipe's on our website. You can warm up your ganache by using ice a cream. You could use it on vanilla ice cream. Yeah. You could double. You put a double boiler, and then you heat it up. So that ganache will uh, end up in your refrigerator for about a week.